Our bedroom is a fortress where the laws of physics are suspended like zip lines from birth to death. Here, in this place, we take quantum leaps toward intimacy with absolute zero hesitation to escape the everyday grind velocity. I'm never, ever coming down from this cloud nine years ago. I was susceptible to obsession, which ate away at me and around the clock. Seven days a week, I would fret frantically about recreating the innocence of 16 Candles romance, but when it came time for commitment, I had a five-finger fist full of excuses that would throw punches at you if you crept closer to me for anything other than foreplay. Three little words to be honored between two people. The one. She is the one. My heart knew it right away, but my hands only knew how to handle bar crowds and the intoxicating reverberation of microphones, so much so that I considered swallowing one whole just so she could hear exactly what was happening inside of me. Because being in true love feels like nothing you can't anticipate. When her arms wrapped around helium me, I couldn't Remember what else kept me grounded all day long and her hands were as soft as dove's wings folding gentle as prayer into my own. Her kiss was as dense as mercury. My temper was tempered by her conducting touch. She regulated my heart, which is made of compressed glass and it is able to take a beat and a beat and a beating before crumbling into a crumb trail from the birthplace of my burdens to the doorway of this sanctuary where I am cast into the depths with my anchor and I can't remember what else weighed me down all day long. Now the one, she called me two years ago plus three last July with three little words meant just for me. For five years, we've been calculating the pros and cons. I put six states between us because I couldn't shake the seven-year itch of wanting her. For eight months, we were silent, but the ninth, oh, that sweet ninth, it gave birth to our longevity. So I reached out across grateful divide, palms to the sun, ten fingers spread wide, love's radiant refraction upon my reflection, the acoustics of her voice. She called me home. Our bedroom was a fortress. Her arms a drawbridge, her kiss a reverie. Our love was a sanctuary. Thank you. Woo!